the Lord with gladness. Serve the Lord with gladness. And the question that I would love to ask right about now. Are you serving him with gladness of heart? Are you serving him with gladness of heart? Are you serving him with gladness of heart? I cannot answer that question for you. Every one of us will have to examine ourselves in light of this word. Praise Master Jesus. But my advice, don't be a reluctant servant. But rather be a willing servant. For if you refuse to render to him, that which belongs to him. The Bible led us to understand. That he is able to raise up sticks. And stone. To praise him. That's what the Bible is saying. So don't serve reluctantly. Don't serve unwillingly. Don't serve him wishy-washy. As we say back home in Jamaica, meaning any and uh -huh. any all. Don't give him the what left, but give him the best. Are you hearing me, child of God? Don't give him the what left, but give him the best. For he is God, he is your creator. He is your maker. No wonder he said they that honor him. He will honor. But they that despise him. He will lightly esteem. Child of God. Saint of the most I. Serve the Lord with gladness. Serve the Lord with gladness. Sisters and brothers, as many that are under the sound of my voice, this is a word of encouragement. Hallelujah. To serve the master and to serve him with gladness of heart. Serve him with a willing heart. Don't serve him any anyhow. Because he is God. He is the maker. And he is the creator. Did the scripture say to serve the Lord. With sadness. And come before his present with mourning. No he didn't say that. He said to serve the Lord with gladness. And come before his presence with singing. Praise Master Jesus. So be enthusiastic. Be filled with enthusiasm. Amen. When you are asked to do something, anything in the house of the Lord, for he said, we're to watch, we are gathered in, in his name. Is there in their midst. Hallelujah. So whatever you were called to do, do it willingly. Do it to the glory of his name. Do it with gladness of heart. Not unwillingly. And not with a sad countenance. Irrespective of what you might be going through. Why am I saying all this? Because we are children of hope. And our hope is in him. Even in the Lord Jesus Christ. 
The Bible says that God resurrected the dead. God called those things that are not as if they were. We see that when Paul and Silas, they were whipped, they were flogged, they were beaten, and they were thrown in prison. They were not murmuring. They were not complaining. The Bible says at midnight, they begin to pray and sang praises unto God in spite of what they were going through. They were serving the Lord with gladness of heart. They were serving the Lord willingly. So I'm saying to you that are under the sound of my voice today, serve the Lord with gladness. Serve the Lord with gladness. The Bible says that the eyes of the Lord run to and fro throughout the whole earth. And he's looking. He's looking to see someone whose heart is perfect toward him. Hallelujah, that he might prove himself mighty. That he might prove himself strong on behalf of that person. On behalf of that individual. On behalf of that one. The Lord is Lord. And he is God. God above God. He is great. And greatly to be praised. It is a privilege. Remember. It is a great privilege. To be given such an opportunity. To serve the creator. To serve the maker. There are billions of people upon planet earth. And the Bible says. It's not we that first love him. But he who first love us. Amen. And the Bible also says. That he have called us out of darkness. Into his marvelous light. So it's a privilege. It's a privilege. Hear ye the word of the Lord. I'm saying serve the Lord with gladness. Child of God serve the Lord. With gladness. Serve him with a willing heart. Yes. Serve him with a willing heart. Let us, as children of God, remain humble. As children of God, let us be playable in the hand of the Lord. Let us be like Isaiah, the prophet. When the Lord God says, who will go for us? Whom shall I send? Isaiah cried out and said, here I am. Send me. Here I am. Send me. Again, I say, serve the Lord with gladness. Serve the Lord with gladness. And that is my brief exhortation for today. As a word of encouragement to us as believers. To know whom we are rendering our service unto. It is the King. It is the mighty God. Give Him your best. Whatever you are called to do. Do it with all your heart, all your mind, all your soul, all your strength. Because it is a great privilege that has been given unto us. Praise Master Jesus. Glory to God. 
And I'm about to pray for the sick. And I think I will do it a different way today. Amen. So as many that are under the sound of my voice, that are on this. As you pray, can you pray for the lady that give the testimony as well? Could you just cover her? Oh, yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that, that's why I say I will do it a different way today. I will be specific. I will pray specific. Hallelujah. Father, we thank you once again. And we bless you once again. And we praise and we glorify your mighty name. Father, may every eyes look unto the art and the finisher of their faith. May everyone under the sound of my voice be expectant. Believe, O oh God, that suddenly, immediately, you can step into the situation. Because you are God and with you all things become possible. Nothing difficult, not too hard where you are concerned. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, my responsibility is to speak the word. And your responsibility is to bring things to pass. As you see fit to do, my Father, my God, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Father, Lord God, I pray that you will send help from your sanctuary right now. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, I pray that every issues under the sound of my voice that need to be readdressed, that need you to step into the situation and begin to prove yourself strong. May you do so right now in the name of Jesus, every tormenting spirit. In the name of Jesus, be the rebuke. In the name of Jesus, loose your grip, loose your hold. In the name of Jesus, ma shekete bibakataye, latasha karalalabo. Father, every disease is under the sound of my voice. Every illness, every sickness, I rebuke the spirit behind those affliction. In the name of Jesus, I serve those spirit notice. I command them to pack their load and make their exit. Now, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, let there be restoration from the crown of their head to the sole of their feet. In the name of Jesus, you sent the word and the word heal them and deliver them from their destruction. Let it be so in accordance with your word. Father, Lord God, I bring your children them before you. May you bless them. Bless them, dear God. Bless them. And Father, I pray for even these that are on the Facebook. Hallelujah, dear God, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. And you too, dear God, my yerebo hunto shakaralabo sata shakaralaba. Lanti shakaralaba sata ye karalaba sata yakata. I decree the miraculous. I prophesy the miraculous. I command the miraculous. Let the miracle working power of the Lord be made manifest in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. That the excellency of the power might not be a first boat of God. Let that which be of God manifest in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. My Lotoshe Kalabasataye. Let the blind eyes be open. Let the deaf ears open. Let the tongue of the dumb be loose. In the name of Jesus, let the cripple get up and begin to walk. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Yea, that the prayer feature save the sick. Let it be so. 
in accordance with the word. We thank and bless you, Papa. We praise and we glorify your mighty and awesome name. And I would ask Sister Robin if she could bless us with a song. Hallelujah. And I thank you, Jesus, for your love to me. And I thank you, Jesus, for your grace so free. I lift my voice to praise your name. I praise you again and again. You are my everything. You are my Lord. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Amen. Glory to God. Amen. And Sister Colleen. Do you want to bless us with a song also? Okay, a little chorus. Praise God. I will praise you, Lord. With every breath that I take, I will praise you, Lord. This promise I made should eternity end and start all over again. Even then, I will praise you, Lord, one more time. I will praise you, Lord, with every breath that I take. I will praise you, Lord, this promise I made. Shed eternity end and start all over again. Even then, I will praise you. Amen. Amen, amen. And my sister was saying, I will praise the Lord. Hallelujah. And I will give Sister Mariam an opportunity to bless the Lord with a song also. We cannot hear you. We're not hearing you because your your your, 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 your mic is mute. The mute. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. yeah. Praise God. Amen. It's the Lord. When He runs on high, He is the Lord. Spoken to darkness, ready to the light. Who is like unto him, never handing in days? He is Lord, and he comes in power when we call his name. He is Lord, show your power, O oh Lord. Daddy Jesus, Amen. and thank you all for watching again, my Facebook friend and family from across the globe. We are about to close our service for today, and may the Lord go with you throughout this week, and cause your way to be prosperous, and protect you, hallelujah, and do mighty and great things in your life. Bless, bless, and be blessed.
in Jesus' name.